Welcome to this Pluto Designer presentation. This video explains how to easily create reporting, monitoring, and smartphone applications. Pluto Designer enables to create unlimited reports in multiple formats. Reports can be generated automatically, and distributed to multiple recipients by email. Reports are also available in a web application, for any authorized user. Users can create new reports easily. Change the name. And define the size and the orientation. The property grid contains a lot of options, to set for example the background report color and the image. Reports are made with intelligent objects, and Pluto suggests a professional object library on the top. Users can create report templates very fast. Object configuration is simple and totally configurable. It requires first three main parameters. Data, function and period. In this example, we want the temperature average value of the day. The refresh button, enables to test the configuration anytime. Other parameters, are appearance options to make it nice. Let's see now the different objects. The object smart value, enables to extract and display any value from the database. Objects can be copy-paste, and the entire configuration can be changed. Smart Label Object, enables to replace the value by an image. Users just have for each value range to select the appropriate image. Many other value objects are available, and the configuration is always the same. Data, function and period. Let's see now the objects with multiple value selection. Like the bar graph. The Pareto. The pie graph and the smart table. For those objects, the pop-up window enables to configure and select multiple tags. On the right section, users can select and define all the display options to make it nice.
For all Pluto objects, the methodology is the same. Appearance options are specific for each object to get a professional result. Other intelligent options enable to create expressions, compare values from different time, detect deviations, display KPIs and many more. Let's see some examples. In this first graph, we can see the energy consumption for every week. In the second graph, we just change the property type to get the accumulated values since the beginning of the month. In the third graph, we want to see the difference between last month and the same month last year. As you can see, the building is consuming more. In the next graph, we want to see the energy consumed during the working hours and the weekends. Users just have to select a data filter. It can't be more simple. In the fifth graph, we want to display the energy and the outside temperature. Users just have to change the axis to make it clear. In the last graph, we will show how to create a linear regression chart in few seconds. In this example, we want to see how the outside temperature is impacting the building consumption. The object's images, labels, and text block will help you to finalize your template with your logo, titles and description. Define the report footer, and your template is finished. Now, let's see how we can create monitoring applications in few minutes. The first step is to create dashboards in this screen format. Then, open the Monitoring Configurator. Create a new monitoring by defining a list of dashboards. Define the timing for each and the position. It's super simple and totally configurable. Monitorings can be executed from a local Windows application. Users just have to insert the monitoring they want to play. More interesting, monitorings can be executed from a web browser. Users can get multiple real-time dashboards anywhere at any time. That's it. It's simple, fast and intelligent. For more information please contact us. Goodbye and thank you for your time.